Jesus name now let's invite the presence of the Holy Spirit on this platform let's invite the presence of the Holy Spirit and to the every name and conquer if I didn't you know the moon function as some rassi oh conquer on bra oh conquer on bra oh conquer on bra oh oh bra oh bra Come, 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 come and have your way, Spirit of God. Please come. Come, Holy Spirit, we need you. Come, gentle Spirit, we pray. Come in the fullness of God and in the power. Come in the whole special way. Come and fed life, O God. We are here to give you praise. We are here to give you worship. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Beloved, I want you to know the one thing that Satan hates because he knows that these are the things that bring prosperity to Christians' life. These are the things that we're going to talk about today and the whole week. Things that promote holiness, righteousness, prosperity. Satan hates that. So please, wherever you are this morning, just join us and let us praise the Lord together. Veronica, Vero let's go. Let's sing praises to the Lord. Amen. Amen. The Son of God is coming again. The Son of God is coming again. Alleluia. The Son of God is coming again. The people sing. Hallelujah! The Son of God is coming again. Let the people sing Hallelujah! 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 And the people sing Hallelujah! Hallelujah!
Oh, 
Father, before then, there is a sister here. You are having stomach problem this morning. You are having pains when you wake up this morning. The whole night, you are having stomach pains. The Lord wants to heal you. Wherever you are, take a glass of water and let's pray over it. Father, we declare that we love. Yes, we love you, Lord. We declare, we declare, we declare, we we declare our everlasting love, love for you. And we will say, and we will say, you are good. Now the miracle, miracle you done has brought us so far to heal our hearts and our hearts. For we are changed. For we are changed. We trust you. We trust you that you will heal us. Grow right now. You are a healer. You are a healer. Father. I will be Father, we declare. Father, Baba, 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 baba,
bayan be.
As the bridegroom, a desiring to walk in the aisle with his bride. So have I desire and determined to walk with you. Therefore, I'm waiting on you to make yourself ready. For everything has been set for you. Seeing there is still time for you to enter into my rest, I'm waiting for you, my bride. I'm waiting for you, my bride. Prepare yourself. I have so many good things in place for you. I'm still waiting on you. I'm still waiting on you. I'm waiting for a day that we will share our love. As you worship me and adore me, I can't wait for that day. That day will take place very soon. So I want you to prepare yourself and make every effort that that day when I come for you, there will be nothing that will stop you from getting closer to me. Draw near to me, for the everlasting love have I love you. With my love and kindness, have I betrothed you as my wife. And I will always love you, only if you abide in my love. And continue to worship me. In sincerely and in faithfulness. We will share love together on that day. There is nothing that will be so exciting apart from that day. That day I will wipe away your tears. That day I will take away all your burdens. That day I will keep you in my bosom. There you will find rest and your soul will rejoice forever and ever. Trust in me, my bride. Walk with me. And desire and determine to walk with me together. In the aisle as a bride. Walk with bridegroom. My blessing. Will I give unto you. Now and forever. Thus hear the spirit of the Lord. Amen. Amen. Yamin Kong Kron, Pesa, Menu Muno at the pay. It was in a senior. Are you frook no energy so on in a year for you, Ebenancia boom? I won't nip and pimp him near Safunine, Nimus, San Amashe, Semino Benancy. 
Me no be nansi weni patu duduwe ni mna mashe wani mwenyamu. Me no be nansi ni meye ni mguasie ni awrehuwa ni yaudie fluso. Wani ema pepe bibri mamo. Mwaya kratu sa mwani mibe nanti ya danu wana. Enche. Enche me ba abe fama yifo yire. Eni nti siye siye huna chun hufrinki kanwe biyara hon. Adie biyara dana me ba wunti mene me nkona ti hufri hon. Na dana ya nije da. We ure befri wu hawa sa asisu hawa nina. Mendo ba tu mekukumu. Na hona wakra eni beji. Dan kwa eni ya wye ye. Siye siye huwa yire. Na chen wura. Na enche me ba abe fawo. Enche. Me ba be fado wako piye ma hin kuro ho. Na ho. Ena meno beti nada. Adie biya rebesi unho kwa yin dano. Bo modi na chun hu fri ho. Pendu duwa sa bo shi da suwa ho ma wono. Bo ho modi. Na shen sa hum jie mu bi. Na dano. Bo kra eni be jie. We yi na nyame yon kron kron. Eka chye yin ano pe yi. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. I know that we are all here and we are determined to make that day. So the only thing that will cause us not to make that day is when we are not faithfully and truthfully prepared. Can I have interpreter? I was I was wrong. For much time, Go ahead. Hello. About your Koso. Shala ba 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 ya. Amen. Amen. I am we there are so many attractive things waiting for us very soon. The Lord is going to give it to them to us. There are so many beautiful things are waiting for you and me. And the one who has promised us is faithful. All that he's expecting of us is also to remain faithful to him. Nothing will stop him from doing what he has intended with our lives. Let us count these blessings and live for him every day. The Old Testament people couldn't make it because of grumbling and murmuring. But our error is hypocrisy. Let us be very careful with hypocrisy. Let us be real. Let us be 
everything that we need has been given unto us. Through these holiness fellowships that we have. Every standard and every secret, the Lord is revealing them to us every day. So we are the people that Christ is expecting to come for. We are walking in blessings. But Satan doesn't want us to walk in that blessings. And so bonu for ni mpesi ebe nanti wo san shirenim. Therefore he is fighting us every now and then. Nti de bia oni ye di akun. But we must determine that nothing will stop us from getting into that place. Now so as I say ya rita so say bi bi bia re ni ho ebe si ya ho kwan akodu sa kuronim. I want us to begin every day with a great assurance that yes, we can. Now, with a great determination, we can do that. We are walking in blessings. Every day, you and me, we are walking in blessings. Because the secret thing that has been hidden, the secret mystery has been revealed unto us. Why is he revealing these things to us? Apostle Paul said these were things that were kept in place for us from the foundation of the earth. Now, that we should walk in them. This is what we call blessing. This week, what the Lord has put on my heart is to talk about what is it to walk in blessing. Or what does it mean when somebody is working in blessing? Satan targets only born again believers. Most especially those of us who are walking in holiness, righteousness, and truth. So one thing that we must be very cautious is that we need to walk together. If we don't walk together, Satan can get us individually and destroy us. We need to come together, work with believers. We need to agree with one another. We may have differences based upon our own perceptions. But that shouldn't tear us apart. We need to affirm one another. Confirm one another. And promote one another. And by so doing, we'll be able to make it. There are levels of blessing that every human being needs to walk in them. The blessing, the same word is called success. Amen. Amen. How can we walk in that successful lifestyle? After we have become saved, we need to walk in divine directions. 
Is it see a Nancy wo a a Amen. 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 There is a battle that begins from the conception. So whilst we were in our mother's womb, the enemy decided to fight against us. I don't know about you, but me, when I was in my mother's womb, mama fell down and her nose, cried, a tree, scratched mommy's nose. The belly fell straight down and that was that is here. It is still here. So Satan had tried to destroy us before we came. And that wasn't enough when they gave birth to us, when he couldn't succeed whilst we were in our mother's womb. When we became children, he started fighting us. He fought us until we were able to marry. Some of you, you had your different story to tell. Sickness, diseases, setback, abortion, failure and disappointment, all were satanic challenges to destroy our lives. Up to 20, when we are waiting for the promises of God to be fulfilled. He made us, he made us, he, he enticed us to make so many mistakes. Some of us, when we were about to marry, that was where the attack also started. We were enticed to get attached and affection towards wrong people. And some of us have gone through all kinds of pains until we reach the level where we are. Another stage that also he attacked us when we wanted to do jobs. We didn't know what job must we do. So picking job, he will attack you so that you be connected to wrong type of jobs. Some of us we choose jobs that we are not happy. Here we are still. Another area that he attacks us is when we come to fulfilling the callings of God of our lives. Satan will see to it that we will not fulfill God callings of our lives. So people like us who have been destined for this high callings, you can imagine from womb up to today, Satan have not stopped troubling us. I want you to take this picture and go back. What I'm saying, I believe every one of us has been victimized at a point in time in his life. But here we are. We are still in the race. 
We have not given up on God. Because he has spoken in the time past. He will bless us. Heaven is going to be the final destination for us. It doesn't matter what Satan does, the blessings of God is a pronouncement that God made before we were formed. When you form Adam and Eve, he said that be increase and multiply, be blessed. What he was blessing the, the birds in the sky, the fish in the sea, the animals that cripple on the surface of earth, God bless them and their blessings still remains. God is still blessing us. When we are talking about the blessings of God, they come in the form of praise. Or congratulations. Abasubum. Or when people salute you. When the blessings of God is upon your life, you see all these things manifesting in your life. You and me, we are walking in that blessing, but we don't know. It is a divine inheritance based upon the promises of God. Amen. Amen. God promised Abraham. That he will make his name great. And through Abraham, the whole world, the whole family of the earth shall be blessed. According to Genesis chapter 21. Chapter 12, yeah, sorry. Chapter 12, Genesis chapter 12. Yeah, Misha Abraham, Bose, Onam Nesuma, a we are singing, Abe Yenshira, and Ampanso, Abe Musa. I will make your name great. And through you, the whole families of the earth shall receive my blessing. So God is say, was saying to Abraham, I'm going to make you happy. And all your welfare, your welfare is going to be in my hands. Now, the same blessing are we walking in it. Hey, having come to holiness, I'm telling you, we are on the right path. Hallelujah. Amen. God told Abraham, if you will obey me, walk in obedience, my blessing shall always be with you. The only thing that will cause us not to have those blessings is when we disobey God. The blessings of God is a commandment. That he has pronounced on us. Now when we follow that pronouncement... It shall be well with us. Amazingly, it's not only God that blesses us, we can also bless ourselves. Sometimes when we say bless you, people are saying, Ah, who are you to say bless? You? Say God bless you. We can bless people. When we share our blessing with others, we've blessed them. When we come to the book of Genesis 24, when Rebecca was going to Isaac's house, the father blessed her. Genesis, most women, 
Rebecca, Elko Nedja Shia, no Nedja Shrano. He said, May you increase to thousand upon thousand. May your offspring possess the gate of their enemies. May you increase to thousands upon thousands. Uh huh. Genesis 24, verse 60. Genesis 24, verse 60. And may you possess the gate of your enemies. So here we see, we saw that even the adulterous parents were blessing their son. They never mentioned the name of God. And did it happen? Yes, it happened. It happened. We have the power to bless others because we are blessed. That is when we curse people, it becomes cursed. I don't think A child of God, every word that comes out of your mouth, it works. Let me be very careful with our tongue. When you say bless you, they are blessed. God will bless them. Hallelujah. Amen. I know sometimes we want to be grammatically correct and uh, we argue about these things, but hey, it works. When I say he was ready to die, didn't he call his children to bring me something to eat so that I will bless you? Isaac did he say that so that God will bless you? Say, I will bless you. <laughs> but when he came, he pronounced, May God give you heaven deep. Amen. 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 Genesis chapter 27, verse 28 and 29. Genesis 27, 28 and 29. Jacob said, May God give you heaven's dew and earth riches, an abundance of grain, new wine. May nations serve you and people bow down to you. Be Lord over your brothers. And may the sons of your mother bow down to you. May those who curse you be cursed, and those who bless you be blessed. That pronouncement was what made Jacob who he was. Every day we need to bless our children because we are blessed. The BIC is Shrian, but his son said, Yes, Shrian. That blessing is not coming from us, it's coming from Jesus Christ. Now, so long as we are connected to Christ, His blessing flows through us. Let us exercise this blessing every day. Hallelujah. Amen. That blessing brings us happiness. Job chapter number 5 verse 7 says, Blessed is the man who God correct, so do not despise the discipline of the Almighty. Blessed is the man that God corrects, so that don't despise the discipline of Almighty God. Don't despise it. There is a blessing when we connect to divine knowledge. The more knowledge we are in the things of God, the more happier we are. The more we are in the things of God, the more happier so God's blessing is attached to our knowledge towards Him. And Amen. 
Amen. God is at work in us. And he desires for us to walk on the right path with him. He wants to bring every changes in us. So that he can display his love on us. So he brings us on the disciplinarian table every day. So that we may not go astray. He's much concerned about where we spend our times. In Psalm number one, verse one to three, he said, Blessed is the man who does not walk in the counsel of the wicked. Or stand in the way of sinners. Or sit in the seat of mockers. Three position number one. We don't walk in the counsel of the wicked. Be very careful the counsel that you are moving with. People that we take their counsel, it can defile us. I know some of you will still have it very hard, but Gabriel, if you don't go upon these sinners, God didn't say that go and take them as friends. That is something that we don't understand. Go and preach to them does not mean that go and tell them friends. I know some of us we struggle with these things. There is nowhere the Bible says that go and take them as friends. So we must be very careful. It's a friendship to the world is an immunity, isn't it? If you are walking in blessing, be very careful because people that touch you, they can drain you. Don't underrate all over overrate yourself that you've reached a level that nothing can affect you. I know some families that they have pastors as friends. But seeing those pastors who weren't godly pastors, straight away the family nearly collapsed. But we must be very careful. Oh, but, but Gabriel, if we don't go to them, the Bible said that we should go and preach to the world. Oh, yes. But the Bible didn't say that we should go and be friends with the world. Nobody didn't say that we should go and throw a party with them. Blessed is the man who does not walk in the council, meaning that you don't do what they are doing. Bible says in Shrani Nipa. They don't advise you and you don't pick their advices. Or stand in their ways. Everywhere that they are going, you go with them. I can't remember one time we went on evangelism Germany and one brother came. To be honest with you, it's a Christian brother. My wife will be my witness. Now, when we, were, we, we, we finished the witness, the Lord was so grieved. This brother came along, and as we were doing the witness, he came, and it took about almost two hours. Annie, uh, Mr. Annie, 
This is my wife say, oh. The Lord rebuked us. Why have we allowed our brother to come and take all the time from us? Ma brother is she that say yeah mra and kasana nyamika ye nim say I didn't see am say a da je wo Abraham. He was a Christian brother. Oh yeah Christo ni o. But God didn't see him like that. Nan su nyami e hu ni so. Let us be very sensitive with these things beloved. Ti mo ma ye nya she ye pa e wo sa ni am e. Because Superman died the arms of the devil on a word. Yes sir say. Wana Oh yes. So blessed is a man that does not walk in the counsel of God of the worldly or stand in the way of sinners, nor sit in the seat of mockers. Oh see, Shrani Nia or Nancy at Boya for any or more nancy and as on snad boya for snabia. We mock people every now and then. We have to be very careful. Mockers cannot make heaven. Sometimes we mock God. You must be sensitive. Where God is sending us, we need to go. Earlier on, I was talking to uh, Sofa Mame that we have st started this holiness in 2012. If I'm not as a great thing, if there had been any person on Facebook that have preached this holiness, and almost every consecutive day I've been preaching on Facebook. How many people have we won for the Lord? If the Lord does not build a house, they labor in vain. I rely solely on God. I can't say that there are some people even in our group that still they have not they are not fully convinced. Not many, but very few. <laughs> Recently, a sister had a dream. And the sister had just appeared on the platform and she was wearing the jewelry and everything. Ah, well, the animal who see me about one bat is So she was, and she said that that sister was not bothered, there was nothing that was convincing her that she's wrong. And the animal no, only I know, there's a fan who who knows there's any way any who know a normal BBI fine when we believe in lies, the agent throw to one when we fight against the truth. That is how spiritual we become. Let us be very sensitive with these things. And stand with the Lord and delight in His law. Meditate upon it day in and day out. Anyone among us, either we make all heaven or not, we know individually. We can lie to everybody, but we can't lie to God and ourselves. Our life is supposed to be like a tree planted on the riverside. Can you listen to the truth without become offended? So I know people argue every now and then with the truth. But we will continue to speak the truth. Those that want to believe, they will believe it. We are walking in divine blessing. What does it mean? Meaning that God has called us into greatness. 
In Matthew chapter number 5 and Luke chapter 6, Jesus spoke about the beatitude and described who a happy person is. Matthew 18, Luke, 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 Yesu Kasafa. Please come again. Nipa, Omo, Ye, Esese, Ye, Ma, Ye, Nibri, Omo. Because that is how the Amplifier Bible say a person to be envied at, blessed, accepted, a person that God affirms is the man. Then he started talking about all of them. Beloved, God is calling us into purpose, his purpose for our life, and we might be determined to fulfill those purposes. Those things are available for us as we embrace the love of God in the fear, holy fear. And order our lives according to his word. Order our lives according to his word. That is only when that those blessings that we are talking about will be ours. Let's finish with Romans chapter number 4, verse 6 to 8. Romans chapter 4, verse 6 to 8. Just as David also speak of blessings on the one to whom God count righteous apart from works, blessed are those whose lawless deeds are forgiven and whose sin are covered. Blessed is the man against whom the Lord will not count his sin. Hallelujah. Amen. We need to walk towards that. The day is coming. The Lord will cover our sins. This is the good report that we can receive on that day. That we will be fully assured that the day that we ask God to forgive us, He forgave us. The day that God said that He had restored us, yes, indeed, He did. We are walking by faith. In the afternoon, we talk about much on that. To walk in divine blessing is walking by faith. But we know that everything that he has said is true. But besides his word, our faith is just mere faith and it is nothing. If we refuse to walk in total obedience, our faith is nothing. The blessings of God will come to pass. So long as we walk according to His word. So long as we embrace the promises of God and walk in them. So long as we follow the instruction that he has given to us. All that he has said is ours. Don't let us feel that we are walking in the blessings. Feelings. Feelings. Thinking is different from feeling, isn't it? Yeah, I think. But let us think. We are working in Him. And when our conscience judges us, because feeling can be very, very deceptive. Feeling can be deceptive. But in your mind, you know exactly. The Lord has granted us all this knowledge. 
So that you and me will prepare us, sir, because he said he wants to walk with us on that day. Imagine on that day. That, that a bridegroom who have adorned himself for the bride. But when he comes, we are not ready. The Lord is repeatedly saying that he is ready and the angels are ready, but the bride is not ready. At least even if all holiness people are ready, I believe that it will have speed up the coming of the Lord. Here we are walking in hypocrisy. Let us walk away from those lifestyles. Let me tell you. Because death can be imminent. It can come within a short time. I told you the last Friday I was upset towards my, my, my girl. And as I was driving, the Holy Spirit said, Be very careful, you can die this time. If I die in this anger, I will go to hell. Although my anger was justifiable. <laughs> Because my girl, she banked my car door. <laughs> Out of anger. So I said, I also have to be angry towards her. And the Lord said, those who are angry towards their brothers will doubt any cause. They will find themselves in the judgment of God. So straight away, I repented. It took my daughter about seven hours or to ten hours before she would come back and say, Daddy, if you say that I banged the door, I didn't bang it, but I do apologize. <laughs> Let her be ready to forgive people at all times. Accommodate people. Accommodate. Let us try and do that. What people are doing, we are not going to give accounts for them. What we are doing is what we are going to give account to. Ask yourself this morning if Jesus come now, can he take you with you? Let's pray that prayer. In the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you for bringing us into our conscience. Oh, Lord, you've spoken to our heart. Talk to God. Talk to God. Talk to God. In the hypocrisy. In the hypocrisy. In the double lifestyle that any one of us are leading. Shall we pray to God? Fighting against ourselves. Arguing about the messages of God. We always have a second thought. Having a second thinking. May God forgive us. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Father, forgive us, O God. As we are walking in this divine blessing, O God, anything that takes away, anything that takes us away, O God, we repent this morning. We bring our hearts to you, O God, for you to channel it so that we will walk in your divine blessing. We thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name. Anything that will cause us not to make it, O God, 
anything that will cause her to fall short in this promise so god today i want to enter into that rest today i want to enter into that rest in jesus name today i want to enter into that rest in jesus name glory 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 in jesus name ask god that in the net of demonic net that you find yourself unaware may the holy spirit set you loose Come on, Pius or Bon Samo a net via right or the fire and why and in no in the demonic net that our soul is kidnapped. May the spirit of God set us free. Net via rob on the phone no the a a via a via shimon. Pray that prayer. Pray that prayer in the name of Jesus. Father, liberate us, O God. Father, liberate our soul and set our souls free. Father, liberate us and set our souls free in the name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Oh, Every plans of the enemy, every demonic net, every demonic net, oh God, wiring against us, where our soul find himself or herself. Father, we pray the Lord, we shall be set free. Set me free in Jesus' name. Lord, please set me free. Lord, please set my soul free. Lord, please set my soul free. I thank you because you love me. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 God, Richard, bless you. Amen. 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 Is there anything that you want us to pray about in a dream that you have had which is troubling you? Or anything that you want us to pray about before we go? If I cho so oh be be up and say your bomb on pie and say I call say that you should be I how and I say or how be that so up and say your bomb pie boom. Hallelujah. Amen. There is nothing like that. Therefore, let us pray. Yesterday, one of our brothers, which which we affiliate with in this uh, fellowship. Uh, evangelist Awudu Rama alias uh, Paul Israel. Evangelist Awudu Rama. I mean, they are doing the, uh, a crusade. So the whole we we're going to pray for them. Every time we we meet, we're going to pray for that. That our brethren. The people who can win the Muslims better are the, these guys. Now, if we don't take care, these people will come and bypass us. So yesterday he said that they need our support both financially and prayer so we are going to do that that prayer is free so do that one and leave the financial one for us to do that one. <laughs> so please lift up your voice and pray that this day that they are going to they are starting on the 15th of february we pray that he said that he will try as much as possible that he will connect us so those of us who want to listen to it live on facebook he will try to do that so we want to pray for them on that day about seven or eight pastors i said wow these were all former Muslims, and I was so happy when I saw the posters. I said, wonderful. So we want to pray in the name of Jesus. Very soon we'll go to Ghana and do crusade, and I'm, I'm hoping I'm counting on these guys. So sh <laughs> that's why I'm so happy. Shall we pray? Shall we pray in the name of Jesus Christ? Mama, mama, ma, Father, you will save our brother Muslims to God. You are the one that has selected this bread, O God, and you are raising this voice in Jesus' name, that our brothers Muslims will come to know you, O God, that our brothers Muslims will come to know you, O God. Father, this day that you have sent to Father to do this evangelism and this crusade, O God. We pray that souls shall be set free. Muslims shall be set free. Christians who are bound in religion. Religious spirit shall be broken. The spirit of religion shall be destroyed. The spirit of religion shall be destroyed. In the name of Jesus. 
They are also the daughters of Abraham. Father, they are also the children of Abraham. They are also the children of Abraham, O God. Esau was rejected. Esau has been denied by Isaac, my God. Jacob and Isaac was accepted. Ishmael was rejected. Therefore, nobody following Ishmael. Nobody that thinks that he relates to Ishmael can make it to God. Father, in the name of Jesus, set them free. Father, set them free in prisons. Set them free in cells. Set them free in the religious bondage. In the name of Jesus. We give you praise. We give you worship. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Those of you who have money and you want to make an investment, invest in the soul winning. Do that because that is the best place to make an investment. If you want to send that brother, I can send you his uh, number and you send it to him. Now, brother, this is what I want to give. This is what I want to give for the way for that for that crusade. Let God touch your heart and let us send that brother something. It's not false, but let God speak to you. When you win a soul for God, I'm telling you, you also you be saved. The chances are high. Amen. Amen. Charlotte, Charlotte, your hands is up. Is there anything private? Then we go to Zoom. Anything private? Yes, private. It's private. Yeah, we are still on Facebook. Yeah. Amen. So let me quickly shout on Facebook if there is anybody there who is bringing a prayer point. Hallelujah. Let's pray. Let's pray for the brethren and sisters who are following the holiness teachings from all the other platforms that may God continue to revive our spirit so that on that day we shall not be cast out. Shall we pray? In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Father, we stand upon the blood, we stand upon the blood. She cut the da 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 bashanda. Yeah, la 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 bashi and la 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 basanda ya. Oh, la 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 bashi and la la basanda ya baba ya. Father, we bring our brothers and sisters to God from all other platforms. Father, we bring the associate with God that your glory shall reflect in their hearts. In the name of Jesus, fulfill your purpose in us. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Maybe somebody is listening to these teachings or watching us from Facebook, YouTube, WhatsApp, uh, online radio, whatever it is. We want to give you an opportunity to embrace Jesus as your personal Savior. Can we pray? Maybe be a UTF, you say Facebook, radio, so YouTube. Kindly pray this prayer with us if you want to accept Jesus. Say Jesus. Yes. yes. I believe you're the Son of God. I believe you died for my soul. Lord, I repent from my sins. Forgive me of my sins. Cleanse me from all unrighteousness. Wash me by your blood. Sanctify me, O oh God. So that I may walk in your counsel. I give you my heart. For your heart. I give you my mind. For your mind. I give you my spirit. For your spirit. Let me love what you love. Let me hate what you hate. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Sorry. Shall we share the grace in fellowship? Now, may the grace of our Lord and our Savior Jesus Christ, the love of God, the safe fellowship of the Holy Spirit, be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord.
forever, forever and, ever. and ever. Amen. 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 You're my brother, you're my sister. Let's go to Zoom. So take me by your hand. Together we will walk until he comes.